So just put the R in the video back on. Hello, I'm Ruth. I'm George. I'm Blake, and we're New Hope Club, and welcome to the final episode, the final episode we're of here. NHC oh, this TV. Season, it's very, very sad. Emotional. It's been emotional, but have we got a show for you today, haven't we, boys? We, we have. Do. It's going to be so exciting. Action and you know what? I feel like we need to fill this. We do. Let's fill a little this bit nice more. little gap here. We've mm. got a very talented man on the show today. It is James Smith. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, cool. Nice oh, sweet. Just, just, oh, she's right yeah. in it. Yeah, it's yeah. lovely, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. Oh, very so cozy. <laughs> 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 what have you been up to? What have you been doing? Um, just writing and uh, trying to get some new music sorted at the moment. So yeah, been quite busy with all that. Nice, very nice. Yeah. Well, the show is full of really, really exciting stuff. I must say, we have a segment each. Uh, are you good at drawing at all? No, no, I'm used to your that's yeah, that's, yeah, that's, yeah, that's what you want. What about general knowledge? Uh, no. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's, <laughs> it's pretty good. good. Yeah. Well, I feel like we should just crack on with the show. Hello everyone and welcome to Curious George. This week, we are customising these flannel shirts over here. They look dapper already, but we're going to make them look even better. Uh, what, what's in there, Blake? Got some paints. Yeah, we've got some, some paints, we've got some patches. Brass patches. For all. Look at this. Fabric paint, basically. 3D fabric paint. Can you make mine good, please? I'm not making yours good, Reed. First thing I'm doing is cutting your sleeves off. Oh, that's what I was going to do. <laughs> <laughs> Get an adult to help you at home with yeah. scissors and sharp things. I feel like I'm on heart attack. Can you please be careful with those scissors? Sorry. <laughs> Let's make it like designer. I might put a little hole for your nipples. <laughs> no, what you please. Think? <laughs> so what's like your personal style? What sort of outfit would you throw on? Um, That's a bit of me. Well, I wouldn't say I'm like stylish, but I'd say I like quite plain stuff. You okay. know what I mean? Okay. I'll always chuck on like a white tee nice. and some joggers. I've so just you got the docks going on. Yeah, I like yeah. a nice pair of docks. Yeah. George is just cutting the collar off of his shirt. <laughs> It's going to be really flattering, isn't it? It's <laughs> quite <laughs> looks like something you wear like a nativity play. I might put some like sick, slits that, in yeah. it. Oh wow. Yeah? <laughs> that is more than cropped. <laughs> no, that's art. So my thought process <laughs> for my, my flannel shirt is to make Reese look as bad as possible. Oh, really. nice one, mate. That's a, that's a sick one. I'm going for like rustic <laughs> uh, model who thinks he's the bollocks. Nice. Wearing that. Oh, <laughs> that's pretty sick, you know. Oh, wow. <laughs> Come on. Like that's not bad. <laughs> Come on. It's actually the white's making it a really nice blue. That's all right, actually. You I think we should do more of this, you know. I feel like Top Man would sell that. Have we got a brush? They definitely would. Can you pass me a, a brush blade, please? Um, yeah, just two seconds. Oh. Oh. Just do like, just do you know what, this is your shirt mate, where do you think you should no, do you're designing like it. A, I know, but like, yeah, like a, I like to collaborate. Yeah. I'm, I'm a collaborate. Just stick them all around. So got one. <laughs> Would you wear that? Or is that like something that you wear in the studio? Definitely not. No. <laughs> I used to wear Uggs. Ooh. Ugg boots. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Ooh. <laughs> Shaking your head. <laughs> oh, use one of them as a bandana. Come on then. Sweet. Yeah, oh, it's so wet. <laughs> okay, we I'm back. Yeah. We've got 10 seconds glue, left. Glue, All right, glue, um, glue, 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 nine, eight, <laughs> Stop the glue. Glue, that's <laughs> five, four, yeah, wait, wait. three, yeah, yeah. two, come on, push it. Wait, what? two, one. one. All right. I personally think I put more effort into mine. <laughs> but well done. I'm worried about the sleeves. <laughs> having none. <laughs> no, I don't really do You could wear it as like a bomber jacket. We'll see what they look like on in a minute. Yeah, we'll We're see. gonna let them dry. The next section is Blake Makes, so. Should we move on to that? Blake Makes! You're Blake looking Blake. at me like I'm speaking <laughs> Spanish. <laughs> so. Nuevo Club de Esperanza son super cool. Hello and welcome to Blake Makes. This is the part of the show where we do some art and yeah, we've already done some art today, but we're going to do some portraits. How are you feeling about this? Uh, I'm excited. We're not using paints though this today, we're using um, Play-Doh, Kiddie-Doh even. 
were you good at art in school or? Uh, no, no, I wasn't. I hated no. it. But I was good at play doh as a toddler. Okay. Well, there you we were as good at play doh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm good. <laughs> this stinks. I'm gonna go for a face. You've got one leg on the other. <laughs> You've got quite defined eyebrows, haven't you? I'm going to give you a monobrow just because it's easier. <laughs> it is easier, it's really realistic as well. <laughs> oh, when was the last time I played with Play Doh? Probably like. I don't know, maybe like. I, didn't, I don't think I ever I had Play Doh. Really? I had Play Doh all the time. That is scary. <laughs> looks like eggs. <laughs> That's scary. This looks like Dracula. I used to eat my own poem. Oh my god! <laughs> Wait, sorry, is that too far? Jesus! <laughs> Me and my brother, when we was about three or four, we used to poop on the floor. Did you eat each other's? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my. Oh. That's Some so messed up. <laughs> so messed up. You, you ever used to do like little float floaters in the bath? You know, like. Yeah, you, of course. When your mum used to put you in the bath and you just <laughs> squeeze that little floater. Do you know what I mean? I, mean, I don't no? remember it, but I'm <laughs> pretty sure I wouldn't. I wasn't at the age oh, where yeah, I remembered stuff. Um, currently yeah, just uh, sticking on the arms. Um, I'm no, doing a full body. You've burnt your ears on holiday. Yeah, you've been on holiday. I always burn my ears on holiday. You forget to do sun cream on them, don't you? I'm going to show them back. That mouth's over. Hello? It's a bit big. I'm going to make his... What colour? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, what colour head? That head. just look. <laughs> Look like Homer Simpson. <laughs> <laughs> That's so good. Drag Blake. <laughs> I think we're done, you know. One hour later. All right, right, we're done. Oh, yeah, right. well, I think we're. Right, Happy? We're down. Mine's not gonna lift up. Is it? I'm dreaming there. Eh? Ta-da! <laughs> <laughs> I literally look like Homer. Just a good-looking geezer. Describe what mine is. Mine is obvious, really. I don't really need to do much describing. It's clearly a very life-like um, version of James. I'm just, I'm really happy with it. It's really good. I'm really happy with it. Yes. I'd be honest with you. Mine is not one. Yeah. No. <laughs> <laughs> if we're being filmed, yeah, I think it's James. James. I look like I think Quack James. Man. Yeah. Well done, James. Well done, James. Yes. Brilliant. On to Reese Reports. Hello and welcome to Reese Reports, the show where we talk about topics and get real deep and real serious. Let's do it. Come on! Come on! Come on! Oui, oui. All right, today we're talking music. Uh, what's in what inspires you? What artists are you listening to right now? What artists did you listen to growing up? What are you what are you enjoying right now? I, I'm, re I'm really loving like Bruno Major at the moment. I don't know if you've heard of him. He, uh, yeah, he's wicked. He's like an amazing guitarist. Is it? Yeah, so I'm taking a lot of inspo from him at cool. the moment. Cool. Nice. Yeah. Is that what like sound you're going for? I think um, the sort of stuff I'm making is like very like musician driven. Um, mm. Although it's like pop, but uh, like I'm really into musicians and, and songs, so I write I write all my own music and I sort of produce a little bit as well. What artists did you grow up listening to? What was in your house? Um, well, my dad reckons he's a bit of a singer, but he's not. He's useless. So we had always had a lot of like old Frank Sinatra and like Ray mm -hmm. Charles yeah. and stuff yeah. in yes. the house, um, but I really grew up on soul music and uh, like old Motown and stuff. Cool. So that was my vibe. But I was really obsessed with Elvis growing up. That was yes. like my guy. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. What what made you become a musician? I think it was Elvis, you know. I think mm -hmm. I, I watched a documentary when I was like, well, I must have just sat in front of a documentary when I was like five or something. And uh, I used to watch like Elvis do the legs with yeah. his guitar yeah. in front of all these girls and all these girls screaming at him and I was like, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> when I sort of first got a, a guitar and I used to sing at um, my mum's mate's dinner's part, dinner oh, parties. Nice. So like, yeah. I used to sing in front of like five people. So they'd have like a dinner. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and they'd give me like 30 quid and oh, I'd do nice. that every Saturday. That was my... I'm sorry. Oh, I've seen some pocket money. Regularly? Yeah, exactly. yeah. Get the bowing. So did you like, um, did you do like the pub gigs sort of? Yeah, yeah well, I've done the pub scene yeah. for a Weddings. Lot. Yeah, yeah weddings. Done all that. First all dance. Yep. Yeah. Ah, uh, oh, classic. Yep. Yeah, all my Brilliant. cousins still asking me to do that. That's <laughs> oh, yeah. really? That's wicked. Yeah. That's so cool. What advice would you give to anyone wanting to start a music career? Learn an instrument 
first mm. um, because that itself is is a way to get into the into the industry and uh, also for like the modern day songwriter I'd say like learn how to like produce and learn how to use logic or pro tools yeah, yeah. or something because anyone can make music now in their bedroom and stuff buy some monitors and a little rubbish sound card and just learn how to like make music from from nothing yeah definitely yeah. yeah so my source has been on the streets this week he's been talking to people asking about their music influences and what they're listening to hi reese how are you doing out there it's been a long old season uh, are you still hanging in hello good lad good lad uh, we love you in the studio don't we everyone we love, hi, you. We love you so much yeah. Reese Reports, we're live. I am here with Maddie right now. We're talking about music. What kind of music are you into? Um, I really like Deep House, Tropical House, Drum and Bass. I love everything, really. That's very cool. Um, have you got a favourite artist? Um, I like a bit of... I don't really like a specific artist, but I like more genres, so French producers, stuff like that. If I could name an artist, um, if we're going back here, my old kind of 80s music, Fleetwood Mac. I love a bit of Fleetwood Mac. Oh. Oh, love Fleetwood Mac. Love that. Uh, do you have memories of your first ever gig? I've actually never been to a gig before. Never. Still yet to go. I'd love to go to Glastonbury or Reading or I've never been ever. Well, you should. You should. Glastonbury. Uh, Leeds Festival, Reading Festival, uh, Glastonbury. Go to them. Yeah, you have a good time. Thank you. No, I'd love to. I'd love to. Thank you very much, Maddie. You've been a great help. Thanks. Alright, thank you very much. You've been a great help. Probably the best part of the show, so thank you so much. Um, and guys, thank you for joining me. Thank James. you. Yeah, thank, thank you, Reporter. The boys, yeah. the new thank hope. You. Thank you so much for joining me. Uh, until next time. Thank you. It's quiz time. This is quick fire questions with James, Blake, and George. Guys, get your thinking caps on, because some of these questions are hard. Alright, let's do it. Question one. Which member of One Direction has the middle name Edward? I have no clue. Ready? Three, two, one. Come on! Yeah! yeah. yeah. Alright, secret Wait, fan yeah. pages! <laughs> Same middle name. Who is the lead singer of Paramore? That's I forgot it, I forgot it, I forgot it. Three, two, one. Paralead singer. <laughs> Hayley Williams or? Helen. Helen. <laughs> it's uh, Hayley Williams. It's Hayley Williams. Question three. How many weeks was Old Town Road at number one on the Hot 100 for? Three, two, one. Thirteen. Six. <laughs> and six. The answer is actually 19. So James is Nine. Nine. Come on! <laughs> <laughs> Question number four. How many siblings does Ron Weasley have in the Harry Potter books? This is a musical question. Three, two, one. Four, three, and five. Well, none of them are right. It's actually six. Oh. I'm not going close. It's six. Oh. Alright. Question number five. What instrument does Squidward play in SpongeBob SquarePants? Alright. Three, it. two, one. Saxophone, clarinet. clarinet, clarinet. It is the clarinet. clarinet. Yes. Is this a rubber? Oh, sick. All right, question six. What is Eminem's real name? Oh, Why don't I know this? It's the name of one of his albums. Three, two, one. <laughs> <laughs> Slim Shady. Obviously, it's birth. Oh, Marshall. Little Baby Marshall Slim. Mathers. Eight Miles. Marshall what? Mathers. The Marshall Mathers. Mathers. Mathers LP. Yeah, it's a good film, that. Which famous singer won American Idol in 2002? All right, sure. Chloe Clarkson. Randy Jackson. <laughs> He's a judge. <laughs> Chloe Clarkson, Jennifer Aniston. <laughs> no, I mean, I mean, her uh, rise to fame was obviously on. <laughs> I meant <laughs> Friends. <laughs> not. <laughs> um, it's Kelly Clarkson. Was it? Yeah. Oh, Kelly Clarkson. Oh, well done. Kelly Clarkson. Abu is a monkey in which Disney film? Three, two, one. Aladdin, Aladdin, oh. Jungle Book. Right. It's Aladdin. It right. is Aladdin. Well done. Three, I've never three. seen Aladdin. You've what? never seen Aladdin? Never what? seen Aladdin. What's Are you kidding? Yeah. Never yeah. seen Aladdin. Charlie Chaplin insured part of his body, but which part? He what? Part of his body? He insured it. Three, two, one. 
nose, moustache, <laughs> and willy. <Really? laughs> it was his feet. So oh, of course it was, because he was a tap dancer. Yeah. Last question, it's a tie for Blake and James. So which wrong. album won Album of the Year at the last Grammys? Uh, is it, I can I, I say the artist? I've not even a clue, but if we don't know it. Go on, you can go for it. Three, two, one. See that one? Oh, oh so close. Close. Yeah. Country album, yeah? But the song was called Slow Burn on the album. Yeah, the song called Slow Burn. Oh wow, I think that Can deserves a win. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Well done. Yeah, for sure. Well done. Yeah, well deserved. Congratulations. Take one. <coughs> it's that time. Well, well, well. Thank you very much for everyone who has watched any of the episodes. We've had an absolute great time. Thank you to all of our guests who've come down. Thank you to, for today, James. Thanks for having no me. Problem. I thought um, the boys are uh, dressed up in their fancy little Yeah, look at it. It's still a bit wet. But yeah. I think they suit you. That's not the only problem with them, is it? Oh, I couldn't see any any other issue. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> The lack of sleeves, <laughs> for one. <laughs> well, thank you very much for watching. Make sure to hit like and subscribe. We'll be back, hopefully, for another season. If you guys like this, make sure to leave a comment, and we'll see you next time. We love you lots. Speak love. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye. Bye.